with your very muscular purchase. This is your puppet ready to go home. In the box you'll get a plate and you'll get a magnet. The magnet's for when you're thick, wearing thicker clothing than what I'm wearing now. So you put the plate underneath and the magnet underneath the piece of clothing and the puppet on top, so the sticks, if you're wearing really thick pieces of clothing. You don't need it for something like I'm wearing now, but it's good for using it if you do need it. So with the plate, um, it will come straight because it's easy to pack. With the, also with a layer of plastic on top. Um, peel the plastic off because just to protect the protect this is through shipping and while I'm cutting it. So pull the plastic off and then with the metal side on top, bend it with your fingers so that it makes a nice curve over your shoulders and it will stay on there quite well. So you just, you just with your fingers, it's pretty easy to bend. So just a bit like that and then that over your shoulder. And then this goes under your clothing and then the puppet on top. You can use the magnet if you like, you don't have to. Um, that's inside the box. And then you'll also get inside the box a puppet. Well, you've got two puppets in fact, and two plates and two magnets. Um, but if you're buying one puppet, you'd get this puppet. Um, so when you first get the puppet, you need to do for a little, him a little bit of exercise. I usually call them girls, I'm sorry. Um, you need to do a little bit of exercise. You pinch the fur at the back, you pull it back a little bit just so it gets out of the way of all the cords and a bit of side to side exercise. Just gently, just work on side to side so the cords kind of move and the fur is in the right spot. As long as the fur gets shifted a little bit and it um, stops, the, stops the thing from moving. So just keep moving it just side to side until, she gets, until he gets in the right spot. And once you're done, you put up the legs so that they're up in the air. You separate the fur from the magnet, that's the bottom of it. And then you put it on top and it should click in when it hits that plate which has fallen off my shoulder. When it hits the plate, it should click in. There we go. So I've currently got a magnet underneath. You don't have to if you don't want to. So it should stay on your shoulder nice and smooth. And then to use your puppet, hold this thing, the string, hold the black bit, push down, make them look up. Push down, make them look up, and then to move it side to side, you hold and you turn. This guy needs a little bit of turning to get him to look side to side, and then you can either, you can, I usually turn it back, but you can just release and it'll flop back into normal, or you can turn it so it's one way. You can watch the video to see what I'm doing in a slow motion. So that's what I do with Tony Puppet. So thank you very much for watching.